It's been a tricky day for everyone from the weather to the traffic issues and the GPS issues today. Just sum it up for me. Yeah, very, very messy day, I think, for, for everyone. Difficult to, to really uh, put runs together. Uh, obviously, in FP1, um, you know, we could run only early uh, in the session. And after that, I didn't, get many, I didn't get the lap, really, on the soft. I got a lap, but it was very disrupted, and, and then it got red flags. So, yeah, FP2 wet uh, on the second part, so also... Got to run today the hard and the medium, not the soft. Um, so no really performance running, um, which is a bit annoying. But, you know, it's, it's the same for everyone. Yeah. And uh, hopefully we can still work on something decent, um, you know, ahead of tomorrow. So on those harder compounds, the medium and the hard, and when you got a clear lap, what did the car yeah. feel like? Yeah, it felt all right. Um, we just don't know exactly where we are and, uh, yeah. and how the car feels, you know, obviously on the soft compound. So that's the big unknown. Um, I'm sure we are not the only ones in that position. Um, and yeah, there is still a, a lot of time for us to, to dig in and, uh, and hopefully P3 is going to be dry. So, uh, you know, we can catch back on the work that, uh, that we didn't do today. If the weather does turn and it becomes a bit tricky again tomorrow, I suppose with the midfield so close, that offers opportunities, doesn't it? For sure, it does offer opportunities. Um, and the good thing is that I have a new set, um, you know, for P3 and a lot of people have run them. Uh, I didn't. Uh, I saved my set. So, um, you know, we'll see. Was that a conscious decision to, to do that? You didn't yeah. feel like you wanted to go out and do a little bit of learning? No, I wanted to go out, but the team thought, you know, if it's raining tomorrow, it's actually better to keep yeah. that set for, for tomorrow. And that's, I think, a good decision. Um, obviously, if it runs only in qualifying, we screwed. <laughs> yeah. uh, me, I started difficult in FP1, um, struggling rear, but FP2 was okay. Um, kind of sat quite happy with the FP2 performance. Um, yeah. We just need, did a hard tire and we didn't need a soft soft run. Pretty much everyone, but um, we don't know, we don't know exactly where we are. So just concentrate what we have to do and uh, just put it all together tomorrow. And the off you had in FP1 this morning. Can you talk us through that? Yeah, there was massive traffic, a uh, bit of a um, kind of chaos, causing from like um, GPS off. I would say. And um, slowed down a lot in the last last sector, and uh, just tire was not ready at all. And um, yeah, as soon as I turned out, just didn't have it, any of grip. So um, yeah, that's it. And obviously, two very different sessions today. Do you have any idea where you will be come qualifying tomorrow? Um, I think we'll be really tight still, um, like usual. Hopefully, I can we can go obviously aim for aiming for Q3, but. First of all, Q2, and we'll see how it goes.